when people are purchasing from you. They expect you to be like this savior, this Superman, the one that provides them everything, especially the lower ticket costs. Having clarity as to what the person actually purchased is so important. A lot of people purchase things based on an emotional feeling, but not actually on knowing exactly what's being provided. We've spoken about importance of results, but it's valuable to consider what's happening with your clients. They might not be watching a webinar, but when they're talking to you one-on-one -on -one and you're such a powerful salesperson as you are, they're emotionally attached to who you are and the result that you're providing them, but they might have forgotten the fine nitty gritty details. When they lose the fine nitty gritty details, this is how we create what we call a PETA client. Now you might like PETA with some hummus and you might like it when you're eating, but you definitely don't want a PETA client because that's a pain in the ass client. And the only reason you create a pain in the ass client is because they do not have clarity on what they actually invested in. They invested emotionally, not logically, and they don't know exactly what they bought. The agency service level agreement is a very simple framework to use. When you get on an onboarding call, you go through the service level agreement to make sure you're 100% on the same page. I am looking at the document as we speak to make sure I give you every single element of this. This is what needs to be included in the service level agreement. First of all, the name of the program, the result of the program, the price of the program, and the cancellation policy, all in the first element. The next piece is the elements that are included, the recipe. The result's the most important, but now you wanna include the recipe so they can never say that you didn't deliver the pieces that they expected. Then you would know how communication works. If someone's freaking out about you not answering in an hour, but you show them in the SLA that you said it would be 24 hours, that gives you the upper hand because they're verbally agreeing to it on a recorded call, or better yet, signing it. If you don't have these pieces, you simply will not be able to have clarity and a successful long-term relationship with your clients, or worse, you have a long-term relationship with your clients, but you're bombarded by them in a million different ways and it sucks and no one wants that.